Welcome back Filmholics, my name is Kyle Kerry, but in this channel you'll find anything and everything filmmaking. So today, i show you how to use the- wait, where's the color? Uh, one sec, here. Boom. Uh, it's still gray. Okay, this thing looks useless. Let's find out how to use it. Okay, so jokes aside, this is actually a great card, but I want to explain what this video is. It's part of a bigger series of videos that I'm making for YouTube. Uh, it's basically how to like your YouTube videos. So I want to start with the basics starting with this, but if you want to check out more of this series, go ahead and click on the playlist up in the cards up here, and let's go ahead and get started on this thing. To start off, I need to explain why is it important to get correct white balance before you start filming. It's kind of a no-brainer why this is so much better. The reason why is because it saves you so much time in post-production. Uh, during that time, you're just gonna have to deal with like awkward issues, hair pulling issues, color shifting in the background when you're just trying to fix the skin tone, and it's just it's just gonna be a nightmare. But with this, you don't have to really deal with that as much. You're gonna get as accurate as you can get on screen, through the camera, and through your post. And that way you can correct it later. Another great thing is that it's only like 10 bucks max to get one of these, unless you get one of the big professional ones that has other features to it. But if you're just getting a great card, it's like 10 bucks max, depending on the size. And it's a great investment due to the fact that you're gonna be using it on every set that you do, especially if you're changing lighting a lot. And that way you can just get perfect white balance for every set and then you don't have to use it for the rest of the filming until you change lighting anyway. Okay, so let's run through the steps on how to do this. It's gonna be very easy to do. First thing you're gonna wanna do is light the set the way you want it like I have right now, so that's done. Second step is going to go to your camera settings and head to white balance like this. Boom, now you're in custom white balance. After that, you're gonna wanna place a gray card right in front of it where your subject is most likely going to be and in contact of the light. So you're gonna have like this and boom. And it should be done. As you can see, it made a custom white balance setting for you already. So the camera should do the rest. Simple. It literally saves you so much time and it doesn't take any time at all. That's insane. So the fact that it's 10 bucks saves you time, little to no effort to do it. It just means that, well, it's a great investment. And if you guys want to get it, you know, links in the bio, not bio, in the description and their affiliate links. So just to let you guys know, there's no extra cost. I just wanted to make sure that you guys get the cheapest one and the best cheap one anyway. And you know, helps out on the channel. Let's go ahead and go straight to the comments. First one's going to be by boy, boy, uh, sorry if I butchered that, I don't mean to. I am just really bad at reading names on comments. But uh, what's happened to Shah Rukh Khan? I don't know who that is, but current events, Google search it, I don't know, but yeah. <laughs> Second one is by uh, Fred Dia. This dude is drunk. I wish. Next one. <laughs> uh, I said I got a new camera. I got the A7S III in this video. And then uh, Isaac says, can I have your old camera, please? No, I'm actually gonna try and sell that one to upgrade that one as my second B camera or keep that as my B camera. Just as you saw in this video, I need sometimes a camera to show other things or you know, just mundane other things. And also that's gonna be my vlogging camera for now on. This is gonna be my studio and film camera. But I wish I could give it to you. I mean, honestly, if I had that money, yeah. But right now I can't because life sucks. 2020. But that's all for comments today. If you guys like this video, go ahead and check out this playlist on how to like your YouTube videos to make it look like this. And also don't forget to like and subscribe and dream on.